Heart Foundation is a charity which is working with young people and adults with learning disabilities and also the disadvantaged. Uh, Rock Foundation provides resources for young people and, and the disadvantaged and uh, elderly as well and we work with all sorts of aspects of people in the community. We work in a, a particularly deprived area within Grimsby uh, where um, many of our students come from and most of our students can't afford to come here. So we have to um, provide our own income so that we can leave our doors open for students who need our help. And the most important thing about the work that Rock does is that we affect people's lives and we do it every single day. And it's an amazing, it's an amazing work because you can see the lives of people changing every day. And it's wonderful. Here at Rock Foundation, we have just recently moved from the Ice House in Victor Street to Home Hill School, or formerly known as the Education Development Centre, just off Hennage Road and the corner of Wellington Street. We've got great opportunities here at the moment, and we're going down the Victorian theme with it being a Victorian building, and we have some exciting opportunities and some exciting things going on here down at Rock Foundation. We've just recently moved in, and um, since moving in, we've tried to convert a lot of the rooms to resource rooms that are more applicable to the work that we do within the Rock Foundation. So we have a woodwork resource room, we have a sewing resource room, we have a craft resource room. The students that actually come here come for various reasons, um, but the Rock Foundation doesn't provide just a day centre for adults with learning disabilities. Our ethos is to enable each student to reach their full potential by helping them to um, improve their communication skills, their dexterity skills, um, and various other skills that they would need if they were ever in a situation where they needed to take care of themselves. One of our exciting things is the Victorian Tea Room, which is absolutely great. You can come in for an old-fashioned tea and, and sandwiches and cake and meals and see all our staff dressed up in Victorian costume and have your old-fashioned teapot and china cups and saucers. It's an experience in this half. We also have the old Victorian sweet shop as well. We can get all of those old-time favourites, things that we used to remember from when we were at school. So it's a great experience. All sorts of other things are happening as well. We're hoping to do a train and scale electric uh, little uh, room out for the general public to be able to come and use. And the other thing, of course, that we are heavily involved in is our shoebox appeal. And, and many of um, your viewers may uh, have seen our uh, advertisements every year and our stories in the paper about uh, the 140 volunteers that we get every single year. Uh, to help us pack and to collect all the stuff required for the shoe boxes that get distributed in various European countries to families and children who either are on their own or very poor. Um, and that uh, is something that actually goes on all the year, th year through. There is lots and lots of opportunities at Rock for our service users, so if you know anybody who's got learning disabilities, then please you know, encourage them to come along to Rock. We have all sorts of exciting things available for them, life skill courses, we have puppetry, we have crafts, we have tea rooms, we have carpentry, we have allotments, we have all sorts of things going on for young people and adults with learning disabilities. If you're at all interested in coming in to either look around the place or to maybe volunteer to help us in the work that we do, um, if you're, uh, 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 you have any experience in craft work or woodwork or you're just a, a guy that has or a lady that has lots of these skills that uh, you use at home, please come in and visit us and have a chat or give us a call and you know we would be more than happy to talk to you on the phone.